So, I have something to show you. And you need to guess what it is. <laughs> Ta-da! Firstly, what can you see? What colours can you see? What colour is this one? It is red. Yeah, it's a red. It's red. This one in the middle, what colour is in the middle? That is, mm, yes, that's yellow. I didn't have orange, so we have got yellow in the middle. And at the bottom, what colour is this one? This one is a bit louder. I can't hear you. Blue? No, 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 it's not blue. It starts with a g, 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 g. That's right. It's green. And before we had a triangle, and now we have a circle. Can you do a circle for me with your finger? It goes around and around and around and around. Yeah, that's a circle. Can you think, boys and girls? And mummy and daddies, you can help your boys and girls if you want to. Where can you see a red, a yellow, orange and green circle where you live? Where can you see that? That's right. That's right. It is a traffic light. It's a traffic light for when you're in your car or on your bike or simply when you're walking. It tells you when to stop. Ready, stop, isn't it? When to go slow and when to go again. That's the traffic light. And I thought I'd bring the traffic light because you can make a traffic light at home and we can put our faces on the circles to remind us when to stop, when to breathe and when to go again. Okay, so first, let's sing our song with your hands flashing, flashing, flashing. Okay, so flashing, flashing traffic lights on the corner, shining bright. Red says stop and green says go. Orange or yellow says slow, slow, slow. Should we sing that one more time? You ready? Hi, Ellie, Amelia, hi. Hi, darling. Good to see you. Hi. Hi, hi. I'm on for Belinda too. Mm. So, one, two, three. Flashing, flashing traffic lights on the corner, shining bright. Red says stop and green says go. In the middle, slow, slow, slow. Flashing, flashing traffic lights on the corner. Corner shining bright. So, as we were talking about before, how we feel sad and how we feel angry, and then we can feel calm and relaxed. I'm going to put a face on here. When we stop, is when we have a sad face <laughs> or an angry face. <laughs> So here I'm going to draw an angry face, okay? Okay, I will show you. Yeah. Okay, so when you're feeling angry or sad, you stop. Okay. Then 
as we said, there is magic in our breathing. So then you take your deep breaths in, in out, in and out, alone or with mommy and daddy, or with your friends, wherever you are, because you might be in your house, you might be in the playground, you might be in Kita, you might be in the supermarket. So you do your breathing, and let's see what my face is all about now with a little breath. See, you are looking a little happier, aren't you, with your breathing? I know you are. Yes, you are. And then at the bottom is when you've done your breathing, you're feeling so good, you can get going again. You can start moving again. So, there you go. So, at the end, with some nice deep breaths, we can be happy again. So next time you're feeling a bit sad or a bit angry, can you try that for me, boys and girls? Yeah, you can try that for me. And maybe today you can do the traffic light, Mr. Ample Man, as we say here in Germany. We can do that with mummy or daddy in the house. Okay.